Hey, welcome back, guys, and oh my gosh, I am so excited. I am so excited. So, uh, like I told you last time, you know what? We have Witchery in the mod, and I actually found something which was really cool, right? It says, what's new? And it actually tells you what's new. So, there's a couple things that, you know, were added, like the Witchery mod was added, and then there's this Abyssal Crest integration mod that was added. Haven't found anything about it yet, but I will be looking for it. And apparently, Slippery Dave is back. I don't know what that means, but we'll, we'll you know, possibly figure it out. Uh, removed a couple things because of uh, duplication glitches and stuff like that. Whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Other stuff added. You can obviously check that out if you want to. It's right here on the right-hand side of your uh, game menu. What's new? Cool, right? Okay, cool. So, uh, like I told you before, witchery. We are going to get going on witchery. Oh, my gosh. I am so pumped up about this, right? So, I did a little bit. Um, in, in the meantime, between uh, last episode and this episode, and I'll show you real quick what I basically did. See, I had already explored uh, quite a bit of area, and it's actually not visible now because I've uh, reset the map, or not map, but, you know, updated the client and stuff like that a couple times. And so um, some of my explored area was, you know, you know, covered back up on the map. But anyways, I had to travel a very, very, very long way because I needed some unexplored area to actually appear on the map. So we could start spawning in some of the witchery stuff, right? Because I was looking for like maybe like a little witchery's, um, uh, what do you want to call it? Like the little huts that the witches are at where you get the coven witches or maybe one of those little witches circles. And in my adventure, well, I found some stuff, right? So I took one of these awesome little plates and, oh wait, I, do I have, can I, do I have to have this thing in my hand every time? I guess so. Uh, so here we go. And I should get, yeah, yeah, a little sparkly particle things and cool. And boom, boom, boom. Here we are. So, um, if I take a look over this little edge, I found this little guy over here, right? I've never seen this thing before. Uh, apparently, it, it's something new. I'm thinking it has something to do with witchery, but I haven't checked it out yet. Um, I kind of wanted to save it as like a surprise for both you and me. So it's something new because what I was doing was I was traveling around and I saw this and I stopped and I was like, okay, this has to be witchery because I haven't seen one of these yet. Right? Makes sense. And then I said, well, hey, if I have something witchery related right here, why don't I go ahead and just start building my little witchery base somewhere around here? Oh, you know, I still got you turn on this thing, don't I? Yeah. Let me turn you off actually. Um, there we go. So did I just like get rid of all the water? Did all the water go bye-bye? That's that's not what I wanted to happen. Meh, whatever. Anyways, so if you look down here. Oh, you know what? We'll just fall in the water. Woo! You can see my new house. I, I'm i not done. It's it's just a started project. Because, uh, like I said, I, I, do, I am so excited about the switchery stuff. I really want to get going on it. But right now, it's just an empty shell of a house. But I thought it was pretty nifty looking. I don't know. Hey, turn off. I don't want to do the water thing anymore. Okay. So I thought we could go check out this little fortress thing together. Because well, why not, right? Um, if I jump up this way, I think that little fortress is over here. Is it? No, I think it's over here. I'm looking at like the map while I'm doing this. So I'm kind of running in circles and stuff like that. Um... That little fortress, it's in the mushroom biome. Where is it? Hold on. Where are you? Whoa, why am I not centered here? Um, let's see. I am facing backward. Okay, so it is behind me. So it is this way. Okay. Mr. Skeleton in, like, freaking army gear over there. That's cool. All right. Anyways, so I'm, I'm really excited about checking out this little, like, I don't know. It's like a castle of sorts. Uh... I mean, I don't know how else to describe it. It's got, like, big old brick walls and stuff like that, and uh, this just looks cool. And I think, I think somewhere I have seen this before, I don't know, in another video or um, back when I was uh, checking out uh, Witchery for the Tragic Magic series that we were doing, I believe I've seen this thing before. But I just want to kind of take a look around. See what we got going on. Because I definitely want to get going on some witchery. See, there's 
tons of villages in there. So maybe maybe this is just a normal village. Why is there lava spilling all over the place over there? Interesting. Very, very, what the heck? Just mushroom. Okay, it was mushroom. Cool. Anyways, um, yeah, it looks like a relatively normal village. Like, it's got some of the normal village things. Like, there's the well right there, and um, what is that guy? Hold on, let's. I I'm I'm kind of scared to go in here because this guy is not normal here. Like, this guy's different. He's a guard from Witchery. Okay, okay. He's got the village, you know, so that's cool. Um, yeah, mushrooms just built up inside this place. But yeah, like it looks like a normal, no pretty normal village. And we got the library here, and you got one of these little tower things. And I don't know if I consider these normal, because you know, some of these things are added by other mods, and like the bigger villages mod or whatever it's called. Um, come on, I, I, can I not walk through a normal door? Thank you. Uh, what else have we got in here? We've got the Tinker's Construct Room there. We've got a well. Okay, okay. So it looks like it might just be a normal village, but that villager's guard, that, that uh, uh, whatever, the witchcraft guard, that makes me think that this is, what the? <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. A mad scientist data pad. That is something I don't think I've had before. Hold information on all matter overdrive, okay. And GMO, scan 0 of 13 carats with the scientist data. This is something new. Th this is something different. Um, I'm very curious about that. But we're venturing right now. Oh, there's the door I could have just walked through. So there's these cool towers and stuff. All right. Ooh, this one looks like there might be something a little more going on on the inside of it. Maybe sort of. Lava just spilling all over the place there. Um, here we go. What do we got going on here? No, nothing, nothing too special, I guess. Um, I don't know. Oh, there's one of those, one of those uh, Universal Coin stores we got over here. Uh, leather, carrots, flint, uh, dropper, a clock, clay. That would have been so helpful when building that house. Because I don't know if you noticed, but it was a lot of brick. A lot of brick and a lot of orange dye, as well as purple dye. Um, wow, that would have been really, really helpful. Wow. Anyways... Um, what else do we got going on around here? What is, what is this lava about here? Oh, there's a chest. Um, do I have any, like, building blocks of any sort on me? God, look at that, dude. The ultimate chest. I still, I am so in love with this chest. Like, there is no way to describe my love for this chest. Um, can I just put you there? Uh, it's not letting me set you down. Oh, there you go. All right. What do we got going in here? Oh, what we got here? A torn page. Oh, this is witchery. Okay. <gasps> Distilling. Oh, oh, circle magic. Oh, bruise and infusions. Oh, bruise. Book. Materials anew. Oh, so we got some... We got some starter stuff for witchery. I know that one of the first things I wanted to do um, was, you know, get going on some of the plants and stuff like that. I think I, I think I have them in here. Um, let me see. Uh, no, I, not a Velociraptor rib cage. That's definitely not it. Uh, I've got some wolfsbane seed, some wool of bat, snowbell seeds. Mandrake seeds, belladonna seeds, water artichoke seeds, and garlic. So I've got some witchcraft stuff already, and I'm thinking uh, maybe I should start like a little farmy farm. 
I'm thinking that could be a good idea. There, wow, there are so many mushrooms. I'm just like looking at the map. And it's like, wow, look how many mushrooms there are. Ooh, what is this guy? I don't recognize this guy. Hey, no. Um, uh, landmine and spruce barricades. And he'll give me some aluminum ore berries. Really? Really? Wow, dude, you got a unibrow like no other. Oh, my goodness. Whoa, there's another villager. Oh, you guys are everywhere. An emerald for four... Man, y'all are like con artists up in here. Like, I'm like, hey, villager trade, yeah. No, we're going to rip you off. No, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen today. So, we are going to try to head back over to my little housey house. Um, where's that little slime island? That's like my frame of reference here. Because it's starting to get dark, and I don't want to get stuck out in the dark. Yep, there's the sun going down over there. Where is that little slime island? Mushroom just stuck up there. Got to get away from them. They're kind of annoying. Okay, here we go. So it's got to be over in this direction. Because I know I jumped off the uh, little slime island to get to my little housey house that I built. And I will be working on that. Um, like if, I, I think I've told you guys before. If you guys want a build episode, please tell me. If you don't want a build episode, like, you know, that just kind of bores you, tell me. That way I know if I should plan one or not. Because I actually, I love building. I really, really do. Uh, believe it or not, it actually takes me a long time to kind of think these things out. Because I do play around with them in survival a little bit. Uh, you know, using creative mode and stuff like that. And, uh, oh, you know what? I don't have any, like, I don't have a hoe. And I got to plant this stuff. Um, hmm. There's a zombie inside. Why are you inside my... Get out of my house. You are not welcome here, sir. Get out. You too. Should probably light the place up. That would probably make more sense. But like I said, I just got started. I, I I, just laid down the foundation. Um. Hmm. 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 Oh, I can make a wooden hoe, can't I? Uh, but I don't even have an axe on me. Okay. Mad scientist data pad. I got to look into that. I don't actually know anything about that. I've never come across it. And uh, there's this other little piece of paper here, like some other GMO, uh, genetically modified organic. I don't know. Uh, I'm just trying to think of some weird word that could possibly mean. Oh, also, while I'm uh, while I'm doing this and making my little, you know, hoe here and stuff like that, there is a couple things I did want to mention um, and a question I actually had to ask for you guys. Um, first of all, I've been contacted by a couple different uh other YouTubers and stuff like that, um, who've either, you know, watched videos or whatever, and have mentioned coming onto the series, uh, you know, joining up to get on the series. And I don't know, um, well, this is more of just telling you this. I am going to contact some of these guys back and let them know that I am interested because I think having a little bit of more collaboration on here would be a lot of fun. And, uh, some of the other guys haven't, you know, with school and stuff like that, they just haven't been able to get on the server and uh, actually, you know, kind of join us for all this, you know, the fun and games and stuff like that, right? So, I will be contacting a couple of them, and we possibly will have a couple new uh, people join the server relatively soon. And then also, um, I'm going to go ahead and cut this one in just a couple minutes or whatever, just kind of showing you that Witchery is getting started, and we're going to go ahead and get a lot of this stuff planted right now, and yeah, all that fun stuff. Um, you know, I want to put them right along the waterbed right now. And just plant some of the stuff up and get our witchery going. I just kind of wanted to show you the, the roots that I've set down here. Uh, we are quite a ways away from home as I as I showed you as I was moving all that stuff around. But, um, yeah, um, I'm thinking about cutting my episodes down maybe to like uh, 15 minutes. So they're you know, just not quite as long. Um, I, I don't know. If you guys enjoy like the half hour format or, you know, I try to keep them at a half an hour. That That's what I've been trying to do. But I am thinking about reducing them down to, oh, I can't move that one, um, something less, something more in like the 15 minute, uh, you know, uh, range of things, 15, you know, maybe no longer than 20. And uh, I don't know if uh, that's a format that you guys think would actually be a beneficial thing. You know, just so the episodes aren't so long. Um, I don't know. I personally, I do. I love making episodes. And if I thought it'd be reasonable to, you know, make two hour long episodes, I would. But let's be honest, you're not going to watch for two hours. So that's just kind of nonsense. Um, so let me know. 
uh, let me know down in the comments or whatever and just give me a heads up or you know what I do get quite a few messages recently on Twitter and I love that because I do reply and I do check those stuff out and so uh, check me out on Twitter everything is down in the description if you want to uh, but anyways guys uh, this is the Revenge of the Sea Team I am starting witchery I'm so excited I need to go get some bone meal just to like bone meal this stuff up and uh, yeah so anyways, guys, I, when we come back, we will, uh, I'll probably have a nice little farm of uh, witchery stuff going. Hey, did I jump on that? I did, didn't I? I have a nice little uh, witchery farm started up. Well, it's already started up. And we'll uh, get going on some more of this awesome witchery stuff. I've got all the cool books, which I know. The first one, I believe, um, I don't is it distilling? I don't think distilling's it. Um, oh, maybe it is. Or, it's the, okay, I'm going to, while we're doing this, because I, I just want to get started, um, there's like this little furnace thing that I got to do. I forget the actual name of it. It's like a fume, is it fume furnace or something like that? Fume, yeah, the, there's the fume funnel and the filter fume funnel. I know this attaches to something. Um, pink, oh, perfume, interesting, um, a furnace, is that it, oh, what is that stinking thing called, um, wait, I think there's a book for fumes, right, yeah, there's a book for fumes, let me see what the recipe for that bad boy is, oops, I believe, where you at, there you go, um, a belladonna flower, a feather, a book, some dye, and some charcoal gives me collecting fumes, and that'll tell me what to do. So that's probably what we'll get started on next episode, because fumes are like really like the core. I mean, uh, I don't know if core is necessarily the right word, but it's definitely where we're going to get started, and you use fumes for freaking everything later on. So until next time, guys, I am Slider Havoc, and this is the Revenge of the Sea Team server, and I'm out of here. Peace.